Texas schools embrace AI grading. The Texas Education Agency will be replacing human graders, not fully replacing, but certainly significantly augmenting. I shouldn't say augmenting. Well, they're replacing some. The human graders are, yeah, some of them are gone. Yeah. So we'll be replacing some of the human graders with an auto-scoring engine. And this is not for multiple choice. This is for written questions on standardized tests, with the only exception being tests written in Spanish. If the AI indicates it has low confidence in its score, the test will be referred to a human grader for review with the human grader score overruling the AIs if there's a disagreement between the two scores. Texas estimates that 75% of tests will be graded without being sent for further review. They estimate this will save 15 to $20 million a year annually by hiring only a third as many temporary graders every year. The state has insisted that while the auto scoring engine is based on similar technology to GPT-4, it will have systemic or systematic oversight from humans. It won't learn from one response to the next, but always defer to its original programming set up by the state. It was apparently trained on 3,000 past tests that went through two rounds of review by human graders and is intended to give the same grade as a human grader would have. The decision follows a 2023 redesign of the STAR standardized assignment assessment to include fewer multiple choice questions and six times more open-ended questions, which actually seems like a good idea, having you know students answer with open-ended questions. I guess they are just like... Well, um, this is a lot of work to grade, so I guess we'll just have a machine do it, which, um, yeah. Critics have raised concerns that a machine may not be able to recognize and reward creativity or originality. 3,000 seems like not a lot of prior tests, huh? Honestly, no. Also, a person, one, two, three, in full plane chat said this is even worse than it seems because those temporary graders, I didn't put this together, those temporary graders uh, who were losing their jobs were generally Texas teachers trying to augment their crappy salaries. Didn't think about that. That makes sense. That's rough. Blech. Cool. Yeah. Controversial take. When did tax priorities shift from roads, schools, libraries first, and then other stuff? Defense, realistically, it doesn't have to be like all of it, but there should be some. When did it shift from that first, then everything else to like rando programs and vanity projects? And then I guess if we have anything left over, I guess we'll pay teachers something. We can, we can call some teachers. Jobs. When did, when, when, when exactly did that happen? I don't know. I'm just wondering, just curious. Cause like I pay a lot of taxes. I wouldn't mind if they went to schools. <laughs> schools seem cool. Trudeau's investing some billions of dollars in AI. Yeah, but our government is also investing in subsidies for homeowners instead of just allowing the market to fall so that people can actually afford the houses. They're just giving rent subsidies. That is actually not the solution. It's totally To let work. the property values go up so the property taxes go up so you can give a pittance of that money to the people who now have unaffordable rent so they can give more money to land landowners. Brilliant who can then pay more property taxes. It's great. It's a perpetual motion machine. Good yeah. job. Flawless. Flawless victory. F***ing stupid. <laughs> I, I wouldn't necessarily have a huge problem with this if I think we were like way down the line from where we are now. This is way massively too early. You can't put this stuff in a position where it could have any amount of impact on someone's future. Um... Because it's like, oh, yeah, humans will grade it if, if you know, it has a low confidence. But what if it is highly confidently incorrect, which we have seen many times? And then if you can dispute it and it will be graded by a real person, then everyone's going to just dispute it and you didn't gain anything anyways. I don't know. Dumb. <laughs> 